Yeah, and a new study takes a look at the issue of mask pollution. You know they're everywhere. They've become a part of daily life now, and there is plenty of discarded masks washing up around the world. Masks have become a way of life in the fight to control the coronavirus. But their life after use is an issue of growing concern. The Ocean Conservancy has a new report on that out today. This is the first time we had some very hard evidence to just sh shed a spotlight on the magnitude of the PPE component of the plastic pollution issue um, and really underscores how this is a new additive component to our existing global crisis. Starting last summer, volunteers at the group's cleanup events recorded more than 100,000 pieces of PPE on beaches and in waterways worldwide, and they believe that's barely scratching the surface of the problem. Anecdotally, the Washington Department of Ecology is noticing a similar trend. This was not a typical type of litter that we saw, you know, more than a year ago. This is a brand new thing related to COVID and, um, it's it's really concerning. Litter prevention coordinator Amber Smith says in places, crews along I-5 have been finding a rough estimate of 60 masks per mile. We really need everyone in Washington to work together to address our litter problem. We need everyone in Washington to properly dispose of their masks when they're done using them, putting them in a garbage can along with anything else. And that roadside pollution has the potential to make its way into waterways and release microplastic fibers, which is why they ask you to properly dispose of masks and gloves in a trash can. And so I don't think PBE is going anywhere anytime soon. And so again, it really underscores making sure that appropriate collection, appropriate disposable sites are available to manage and handle PPE, which is a necessary form of, of plastics use but also at the same time, continuing to push aggressive policies that phase out and manage the rest of the plastics we use in our daily lives. Now, don't get it wrong. Nobody is saying don't wear a mask. They say if local guidance allows for it, use a reusable one like this. Or if you are disposing of these disposable masks, cut that ear loop so it doesn't have the potential to tangle any wildlife if it ends up somewhere it shouldn't. Live in Seattle, Michael Crow, King 5 News.